Fuzzy Luzzy Van Life. Welcome back to Fuzzy Lizzy Van Life, guys, and part two of our North Devon vlog series. We hope you enjoyed our adventures at the Valley of the Rocks and the amazing hike. It's time to get sorted for the day at our campsite. The weather is absolutely beautiful. Everyone's had a good sleep. So we're going to uh, turn this van around and get some breakfast. <laughs> Otto and I have got really nice this is nutty and honey porridge and Laura and Elliot have got strawberries and cream. I was enjoying a bit of sun over there. It's just here. Yeah. Dogs are chilling. And we're heading off today to explore a bit of a walk not as challenging as yesterday's over the Valley of the Rocks and we're gonna meet up with them. Um, Elliot and Otto's grand and granddad. Your dad and mum. Yeah, my parents, also known as. And uh, we're going to enjoy a bit of a walk between uh, Tar Steps and Withypool. So Otto and Elliot have done the dishes. We're all packed back in. And it's time to roll oh. to uh, the Tar Steps. Transport are squeezing down some narrow Devon lanes. We've made it to the Tar Steps car park. All right, see you in a sec. It's van life, mother. All parked up. We've picked up an extra couple of uh, hikers with us today. My parents, aka Granny and Brenda. We'll meet them. <laughs> Hi! Hello! Hello. Uh, yeah. Let's explore. It's a one-way system. It's a one-way one system, system apparently. Bear is particularly eager today. It's passing Tar Farm, which looks very nice. Ooh, there's cream teas. Cream teas. If you've ever been to Devon, you know that a cream tea is a must. We shall be enjoying one of those while we're here. We have made it to Tar Step, which is essentially the start of our walk. There again, enjoying a bit of a paddle and some drinking. And the time to cross the oldest clapper bridge in the country. Crazy because these rocks are huge, but in 2012 they were washed away by flooding alone here. Clearly, today looking a hell of a lot more idyllic. And this is huge, man. Their massive a clapper bridge apparently is uh, built on piers, which are these bits, and then the massive stones laid on also, top. Also, we might be able to go in it later. Though. Yeah. Mum said we might be able to go in it later. Whoa! Look how deep it is. Don't mind Otto. Mind the dog here to go and pass. Thank you. Uh, 
someone is uh, crossing the river. It's pretty deep. It is a ford as well, so you can go across if you've got it's the right smoking, vehicle. It's smoking. Just the SP. Yeah. Get that easy. Yeah, I reckon Mando could get free. Oh, nice bit of a steep climb to start. And here's Elliot and Granny, also known as my mum. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> and there is the scenery so far. The sky is crazy blue. Just going to uh, inspired by Beck and Eamon. Shout out to those guys, and it is a beautiful day for it. We're going to see how many we can get in today. Beautiful day for it. Beautiful day for it. Hey. Cheers, Dad. Bear loves to drink. Bear and Juno just made some friends there with a lady and her dogs. And we're still heading on the road down to Withypool. Sorry, I'm walking backwards, it just doesn't hurt my leg. Yeah, that's just taking the hill backwards. Styling out. My legs, eh? And we're just coming down the road into Withypool, which is our halfway point. I think a tea room might be awaiting us somewhere. A woodchuck, a woodchuck. The second verse is a woodchuck would chuck as much wood as a woodchuck would chuck if it could chuck as wood. It's backwards. How much wood could a woodchuck chuck? Second verse. We aren't going to be disappointed for scale. Thank you very much. Okay. Awesome. Take that out of the way as well. Cheers. So we've got massive scales. Do you want, do you want a glass Some of Some delicious it? looking uh, coffee and walnut cake round. And the important yeah. ingredients to any cream tea. Clotted cream. 
Which way are we doing it? Cornish and or jam. And jam. Cream first. Oh, and Otto's got a delicious ice cream here. And milkshake. Got it, Otto? Alright, if you want milk. Have you got okay. it? Can you have it? Whoa, it's got bits in the bottom. Nice. Okay. Dig in. Okay, Danny. The correct way, the Devon way. For those that know. Oh my dad and Elliot just checking out what must have been the uh, village petrol station a good while ago. Pretty cool. Pee pee pop! Pee pee pop! Yes, it is. Bedpan style. Not bedpan, sorry. If you are in Withy Pool in North Devon or near the Tar Steps, absolutely worth the walk which is pretty awesome we've got halfway to go but this tea room is absolutely awesome their withy big cream tea as you saw was colossal and fantastic definitely check it out i'll pop a link in the description and it's time to head up a steep hill apparently and we're heading back to tar steps where we started our walk and we're going to walk off our awesome Cream teas, milkshakes, ice creams, cakes, coffees, teas, and milk. Yeah, we've got uh, after cream tea legs going on. How heavy are your legs, Otto? Very heavy. <laughs> Enjoy of a country walk. That's when I later found some wild strawberries. Tiny but tasty. You try one of them. I'll try one, now, can I? Try one. Yeah, that one. Yeah, if you can see it, they are teeny tiny. As wild strawberries generally are. Let's have a go. Mmm. Oh, a pack full of flavour though. Alongside the river that leads back to Tar Steps where we started. Looking rather splendid in the sunshine. if you'll be able to see it but there are oh there's two there's two herons one is just flying there and one has just landed where the other one has just landed so the way you just have said they are a couple so we'll approach very carefully and we see if we can get a glimpse of them Beautiful 
we can hear the call of a lesser spotted otto it calls across the river to its mate is there a reply no its mate has clearly gone somewhere unlucky otto Hi, are you okay? Apparently this bit is rather muddy and slippery. Steady as she goes. Whoa, they weren't joking. I would suggest that that way is actually better than the way I've come if you can go up to here, Elliot, and then across to there. Negotiating the muddy section like champions. steps and it's still bursting with energy. It's been a fantastic walk over to Wivy Pool and back again. Great to have uh, Anne and George joining the Fuzzy Luzzy Van fam for today as well. We'll head back to uh, Tar Steps and I think we might take a short trip into uh, Linton and Nymouth. Taking some more ocean air, have a bit of a wander, maybe grab a bike later as well. I hope you've enjoyed the views. It's been absolutely beautiful around here. A really great walk. Otto and Bear still got plenty of energy too. Yeah, and also we think we might be going down to where is it? So Linton and Lim, that's what I was saying, man. You good, isn't it? Go down to the rocky beach. <laughs> it's so hot. It is hot today. Beautiful skies for it, though, eh? Mm-hmm. It's literally blue. <laughs> Spotted it. We are back at Tar Steps. Head down to Limmer.
soft slide is one, and let's head to Linda. Just in the fish and chips line with some fish and chips social distancing lines. The Esplanade fish bar. Should be tasty. We'll see if we can recommend it to you. As you can probably see in the bag. Fish and chips are in effect. So we're just going to go and find somewhere to enjoy our evening meal. What's happened, Otto? I got cut by a barnacle. Cut by a barnacle, eh? Seaside wrists, yeah, eh? Yeah, would be, wouldn't it? We were trying to get across the rocks all the way along the beach and I slipped. It's not that bad. It just sure. stings a little. I'm sure Elliot will sort you out of his first aid kit when you get back to the van. Yeah, definitely. Back to Mando.
Fuzzy Luzzy Van Life.